Evening, everyone. T Speaker 222 XRP, future millionaire with Side Banner X. I'm the future Digibet OG. Some breaking news. Like I told you all day, all weekend, this was going to be a disaster for Bitcoin when we started the futures. We just had a sudden drop and cleared out some more levels, guys. So if you wonder why I'm the best in the business, this is why I'm the best in the business. I don't give a fuck if you believe me or not. I know what I'm doing. I'm confident because I know I'm the best at what I do because I practice and I study. And I try to better myself when it comes to the technical analysis every single fucking day. Even though some of you guys would say, well, what the fuck do you need to better yourself for, Tom? I mean, look how you're nailing this day after day. I don't know why people keep giving you shit. Well, that inspires me. When people give me the shit, when they spam, when they do what they got to do to try to call me out. When the bigger channels make it look like I don't know what I'm talking about. That inspires me more than you guys could ever imagine. So it makes me want to do what I do more. Because then it proves them wrong, which I can do without any help from them. Um, but one we haven't talked about in a while is the eighth bar. And look where my line's at. You guys can go back to my videos. I'm not just putting these in. A lot of people claim I am. That's been there for the better part of since, well, since H bar was way up there. I told you I had to come back down here. I mean, that's nothing sort of spectacular. That rivals my AGI call. This has dropped better than 40% to my exact support line. Now would be the question you have to ask yourself. Is H bar going to get all the money dumped into it? And are we going to have an all-enticing double top way up there? Or is it just going to do another waving like it always does? So, but if you ask yourself why you should join my channel, why I'm the best in the business, or if I'm even good at what I do, look at this, guys. I mean, I basically put it all on the line again, and I've been calling this. When everybody's telling you Bitcoin's going to 50000 again or fifty two, when XRP's never going to get below a dollar, I've been telling you time and time again, these FUD stations are so full of shit, they have no idea what's true anymore. The guys who claim to do technical analysis have no motherfucking idea what's going on. Like I told the Doge guys, go watch my Dogecoin and you. I told them, you want to know how you know Dogecoin is going to dump? Whenever Miles says he's going all in, within hours, it, I'm telling you guys, within hours it always dumps. And again, I can show you proof. I can show you proof once again. Watch this, guys, again. Why I'm buying now, I'm loading up on Dogecoin right now, seven hours ago. Seven hours ago. Literally, seven hours ago, guys. He always says this. I'm going to go all in. I'm buying right now. Every time he says that, it literally dumps off the map. I've been telling you guys for the better part of two weeks that Dogecoin is going to dump off the map. And it's going to probably go past the double bottom. And look where we're at already, guys. That looks like hell. But look where we're at with this. Go watch my Dogecoin. What am I showing you that for? Go watch Dogecoin and you. But XRP, again, struggling with the dollar. And this could get very dangerous very quickly. So this is an urgent warning to you guys. Pay attention because we're under 46000 and we are crashing hard. So, I mean, before you blink, we could be down another 5000 I mean, I'm being dead serious. This drop out of the bear pennant, nobody believed me once again. I mean, some of my audience did, but most of the new people kept asking. But it's one of those things where I feel like one of these days, everybody's just going to come to my channel and be like, you know what? Like I told you while we were in a run, when I started telling you guys what was going to happen, I said, the people you need to pay attention to when we're going up are the people that are throwing caution to the wind and are telling you exactly what's going to happen to the downside and taking all the criticism. I take all that criticism and more every single day, and I fucking thrive with it because I know at the end of the day, I'm going to lead a whole army, Tom's army, into 2023, and we're going to be more prosperous than you can ever imagine. If you don't believe me too fucking bad, I know it's true because I've taken myself from 11 cents in the bank to many, many, many different things twenty thousand dollar trailer into a two hundred and twenty thousand dollar house you know simple things i i I don't need possessions but it was something it's simple things like that having my twenty thousand dollars in metals physical metals and building up things in the stock market well not the stock market but the commodities the mining stocks and having the crypto and having things in other places in my ira that you guys see my the one i started myself it's just this has given me that opportunity, and I told myself I would help every single person who was willing to listen. If you don't want to listen, I don't really give two fucks, but every single day when I tell you what's going to happen, this is what happens. If I'm warning you, obviously I know something's up. If I'm not in positions, there's a reason why. When I'm taking money out of my portfolio to get it back down to a reasonable... I only have $3,500 in my portfolio now. Only back 
two years ago and here, I would have had a hundred dollars. And this is this portfolio with crypto. I also have three thousand dollars in my commerce resource fund that is currently on the sidelines. I have my twenty five hundred IDEX fund. I have my twenty five hundred for Fortuna Silver Mines or B two Gold, whichever one I choose to go to when it crashes. So there's a lot of funds that have been created now, and it's all come from technical analysis. I know what it's like to be flat fucking broke. I was as little as 20 months ago. My life changed forever 20 months ago after I really learned the charts. I had a run before 20 months ago where I made like five or $8,000 in the stock market. I lost it all, except for what I threw in metals, but I lost the whole fucking thing. I, I think I bought like an ounce or two of gold, an ounce of gold, and maybe 20 ounces of silver, Something like that. But I ended up losing the rest of it because I thought I knew everything. I didn't really understand. And that's when I was like, you know what? I have some ability, but I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I got lucky. So. That's exactly what we're dealing with. What the fuck is this guy doing? This guy just stops on a dime out here. Fucking, like a fucking lunatic. Must be, uh, must be... Delivering food or something. Jesus Christ. Anyhow. It's alright. I got my karambit on me. So I don't fuck around. So. I encourage you to subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. Turn that bell notification to all. Because guys we're crashing. And I'm going to come back to you when appropriate. But as you can see. XLM is very dangerously close to breaking that 30 cent level. And that's. I told you. We're fucked. We closed under 31.6. I told you when we closed under $1.05 with XRP. It was a problem. I did say it. I've been saying it. But DGB, I even said we're in danger zone, guys. Danger. And now we're almost back down to that five cents. So stay blessed.